Hello everybody, I hope everybody's having a great day today. So this video is twofold. The first is an unboxing. Unfortunately not PR, I wish. <laughs> I wish. No, this is something my husband got me from Sephora at 20% off. There's a peek, and there we go. And a try on of a few of these products. So if you are interested, please continue watching and be sure to subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell. Alrighty then. Okay, let's start with the haul of this haul and try on. So hopefully, <laughs> as I said before in a previous video, you want to come and visit we shall have coffee and a good talk. <laughs> but anyway, it's... I don't even know what I was saying. Okay, so yes, hopefully this video won't be too long for you guys, but a bit of a haul and a try-on. I did, I think, most of the makeup, except for what I want to try on. Um, let's start off with... I got a couple of samples. I got this Westman Atelier. Uh, which I'm thrilled to be able to try. I've got this Hollywood Flawless Filter from Charlotte Tilbury, a mini. Finally, they had it in, and I can't open anything. Ah, oh, shaking again. I hate that. Honest, I'm trying to hurry. I really am. <laughs> um, yeah, I think I might actually try that today. I might try that today. I got a small bronzer, Natasha Denona. Who was it? I, I watched so many people and so many videos, I can't remember, but there was a person who said that she loved this bronzer. So I'm like, you know what? I've got everything except bronzer. <laughs> I'm going to give it a try. But not today. Today is something else. Sorry about that. My phone's going kablooey all at once. Um, and another sample I got is this Capture Total from Dior. And I know I love this. I want a big one. I want, don't give me little ones. Give me a big one. <laughs> uh, let's see, what else did I get? Ah, yeah, Bobby Brown. Oh. This one was $25. It is itty bitty, but I could afford that. <laughs> it's not the big one, but I want to try this. So. Now I've got these two that I need to try, the Tatcha and the Bobbi Brown. I'm going to put that back in here for now. Um, and I got a Rare Beauty concealer brush. And that is because of, well first of all it looked great. And it was uh, not too outrageously priced, like the foundation brush was $36. I would have loved to get it, but you know, one is better than none. And, um, oh, what's her name? Amanda Zed recommends these brushes, highly recommends these brushes. So, seriously? <laughs> what am I gonna do at Christmas? <laughs> Oh, and my husband has to wrap all this stuff after. <laughs> uh, criminy already. The ones I really, really, really want to get my hands on are the uh, Rose and Ben brushes. I really want those. There we go, finally. Oh, it's so soft. Happy about that thrilled about that. Yeah. Very, very happy. What else did I get? Oh, I 
I might end up using this because I think I, I think I know what I'm going to do for my eyes. So this also recommended by Amanda Zed, and she loves this brush, this number 18 brush from Sephora for her cream shadows. So as I shake my way through life, she loves, loves, loves these brushes. She said, get, it's not, because I find pencil brushes, you can barely move the top of them and it, it, it feels hard. And I, I love this one, which is a Morphe, funny enough, because it's not stiff. See, it's got bend. And this one has bend. I like that. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. No, it doesn't go that way. All right, it's going to go this way. No, i got to keep it out. <sighs> I'm worse than a kid at Christmas. And I got the Tatcha Pure Silk Powder. I've seen a couple of videos where people either love it or hate it. There doesn't seem to be an in-between. It's either love or hate. So I wanted to try it out for myself. And we might do that today. We shall see how it goes. My foundation doesn't look great for some reason. Okay. Don't know what that's about, but okay. Um, <laughs> I'm not using this today. This is this is precious. This is the Tatcha Luminous. Well, it's the mist. L Lumi Silk Mist. Yes, I have a problem with making sure that my boxes don't rip. I don't like ripping boxes. <laughs> but this is heavy. This is glass. Even for a sample. Well, it's not a sample. It's, But it's still bigger than... It's bigger than the sample, but smaller than the... Regular, this is heavy. It is definitely glass. Okay, I'm happy. I'm very happy. The problem I have is the happier I am with some of these products, the sadder I will be because that means I want to get the full size but can't afford the full size. Yeah. I got these two serums because they were seven dollars a piece and I'm like serum we'll see my skin can use serums <laughs> like I don't know what happened to my face today but hopefully makeup will cover it uh, so I've got serum uh, da -da -da -da, lychee and mushroom so there we go. There's not much in them. Like they they look like half bottles of serum. Maybe that's why they're so economical. And I finally finally got oyster pearl. So as uh I'm as of now, I think I am happy with my collection of Charlotte Tilbury eyes to mesmerize. I think I'm happy. Finally got oyster pearl. That's what I'm going to use today. And you're going to see what's coming up and you're going to go, why are you using oyster pearl? And the reason is because I want to. <laughs> I've been waiting a long time to use oyster pearl. And the palette that I have is going to take a lot longer than doing the rest of my makeup. So hopefully it won't be too long for you. And then I got Glow Wish Bronzer. When I was at uh, Sephora the last time, they only had the big bronzers. And I don't want a big bronzer. I want a bronzer to go with my uh, blush. I want, I want it to be itty bitty. So, okay, it doesn't open now. Look at the size of this. It's perfect. It's perfect. It's perfect. It's 
perfect. Okay. There's that. And here, these are my very first Huda Beauty products, by the way. I have never been tempted to buy Huda Beauty. I don't know why, but just never came into my head to buy Huda Beauty. Uh, I was like, it's overpriced, it's this, it's that, just not interested. And then this palette came on sale at half price plus 20%. So I ended up paying $36 instead of 88. And I put it on backwards because I had to look at it. So I can't show you until I take it out. And it is the Metro the Mercury Retrograde. I know everybody has had this for two years. I have not. This is new to me. And this is as close to the rose quartz as I'm going to get for the next two years. <laughs> Unless the rose quartz goes on sale, I'm not going to be able to buy. $88. Are you kidding me? So I did the math. This was $36 for me. $36 instead of $88. Like, really, really economical. And now there is one last thing. More mini lip products with lots of sequins. I will save the sequins like I did last time. <laughs> Why not? And this one is... I, I, I love the way they look. They, they are so pretty. Okay, I've got to put this somewhere where it's not going to fall. I mean, look at these. Look at how pretty that is. Let's see. Oh, even with glasses, I'm not going to be able to read that. A nice nude. Okay. And this one is... Oh! Ah, 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 ah. Beautiful! And this one is... <laughs> I'm so thrilled. I think I'm going to wear this one today. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, so this... Now I have to be careful because the last thing I want is to break off the lipstick. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put them in here. No, I'm not. I'm going to leave them there for now. So, the other reason why... I'm not doing the Metro, the Mercury retrograde is because I need to look at some more videos on how to put these colors together because I'm an idiot and it's going to take a while. Whereas I figure with the other, the eyes to mesmerize should be a lot quicker. Okay, so what are we going to do first? Bronzer. Bronzer, bronzer, bronzer. I just don't want this video to be forever because I know a lot of people get antsy. I don't mind long videos. I, I like having them on. But not everybody's like that. Okay. So let us see. I've got no contour on. I've uh, been doing a lot of thinking about my project pan for the new year. Um, actually, I had something on my brain, and as soon as I sat down, it went away that I wanted to talk about, but pretty standard. You're ready to mention it, and poof, it's gone. Okay, I should have looked at the camera first. <laughs> oh, it's beautiful. It is beautiful. Yeah, it is really nice. Yeah. 
I do know that I want to do a shop my stash. I don't know if it's going to be weekly, bi-weekly, whatever. I don't want to do it only once a month because I want to learn about my products more and with my I, I, I have the memory of a chicken so if I do it only once a month by the time three months is down the road I will have forgotten what the first batch of products was all about so I have to do it a little bit more regularly especially with face products oh I remember what I wanted to mention it is about my um, now what's the word I'm looking for my low buy no buy and this is in the color it's in the color Bridget you're old get your reading glasses out that's what the color is Okay, right, let's go with the bronzer first. That Soft Radiance, Medium O2, and Caring Coral O2. Okay. I cannot do a no-buy, low-buy. I can't. I can't. I have, I've been trying it all year. It's not worked very well for me. But what I have thought of which might be better for me, is to do a budget. Every month, this is how much I have to spend. So if I want, like, okay, let's go with the number I came up with, which is $100. Every month, I'm allowed $100 to buy makeup. I know it's not a lot, but that's the way it has to be. Kind of trying to make up for the no buy, low buy fiasco of 2021. <laughs> but what that means is if I want to spend $200 that's my cart at Mora Co Cosmetics right now Mora, Mora, Mora Beauty <laughs> is $200 right now that's two months worth I think I'm going to have to do that because when you think about it $100 a month is $1,200 for the year. That's a lot of money. So, I think I might be able to do that. This is a very beautiful color. It's very pigmented, because I barely touched it. Yeah, that's why I want the minis. That is why I want the minis. Okay, so now, <laughs> okay, I'm going to put this on my finger. <sighs> Concentrating. What do you guys think? Next time I can get a discount, I'm going to buy it back up. <laughs> it is nice because I should not be wearing in your face highlighter, no matter how much I love it. And, and this is just enough. Oh. I'm thrilled. I'm thrilled. I'm thrilled. Where's my... That's why I need to clear my desk. Because I can't find anything. Alrighty then. Okay. We know I'm channeling Amanda Zed now. Oh, look at how beautiful that is. Okay. Hey. 
So let me know what you think about my idea of just doing a straight budget as opposed to doing a no buy, low buy. Because I can't do a no buy. I just, I don't have the willpower. <laughs> I just don't, I just don't. I tried. Oh, this is beautiful. And I do like this brush. I really do like this brush. I wish it had a, a little more heft to it though, because it, it almost feels like I'm not holding anything. I, I have a love affair with cream bronzers and I need to get my hands on the Ulta liquid cream bronzers, I'm sorry, liquid shadows and cream shadows and I have to get my hands on the Ulta ones and I just don't know how. That's another thing, that's $300. <laughs> But that's the other part. That's I forgot to mention that if I ever get any money from YouTube, <laughs> it doesn't look like it. Um, but if the YouTube's ever sends me any money, I will take that money and put it back into the channel, which means makeup. So because that will be essentially money that's not coming into my pocket. It'll be a straight in and out. So on the off chance that I ever get enough in my YouTube kitty for them to send me any kind of money, I will be able to buy more makeup. I've also been thinking about adding that dollar sign that everybody seems to be putting on their videos on their channel. Uh, I'm not sure if I should. I'm not sure if I want to. Like I don't want I don't want to give the impression that I'm looking for a handout because I'm not. I mean, if you want to send me money, yeah. Well, I'm not going to say no. <laughs> but I don't want to give that impression. I do want to make money off of this channel, but that is not the main reason I have this channel. This channel is for me to vent to you guys, to have fun with makeup, trying to learn how to do makeup. That's what this channel is about. I would love to make a living off this channel. That would be my dream come true. I'm telling you right now that I... I would be in seventh heaven. But I know that's not how life works. So let me know if you think I should not put the, uh, whatchamacallit on? The money request button. If you think it's insulting. If I don't hear about it, I will put it on next week. going on with my my camera figured out what's going on with the, my camera so yeah if I don't hear anything from you guys about not liking the button I will put it on next week maybe or the week after whenever I decide to not be lazy <laughs> and if you guys tell me you really don't like that idea then I won't put it on
because we know money makes the world go wrong. Because I'm not, I'm not going to get, um, what's it called, PR. I'm just not. I mean, I'm, I'm not big enough for that. I don't think I'll ever get big enough to get PR. As much as I would love to get PR. PR. <laughs> How about Maura? Maura, Haley's? Yes, yes, yes. I can name Charlotte. Hi. <laughs> but no, realistically, I know that's not going to happen. So I have to stop buying as much makeup as I have been. So the no buy, low buy, I know does not work. So it has to be by budget. And this is beautiful. And I shall return after I get some mascara on. And I'm back, looking gorgeous, if I do say so myself. <laughs> I love this lipstick. It's so creamy. It is, oh, I love it, love it, love it. And I know I can't have a big one because there's no way I'm going to go through it. I mean, for heaven's sakes, I'm still not even finished this one. And I've been working on it since the beginning of the year. <laughs> You can send me all the minis you have in your collection. I'll take them all. I'll take them all. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, once again for spending this time with me. Hopefully it won't be as long. <laughs> Please leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. <laughs> Mind went blank as usual. Like my video and subscribe to my channel. A bientôt.